Hey YouTube, uh, thank you. Meet me again uh, after such a very long material like the last time that I create about <coughs> tutorial in Stata. Uh, maybe you still remember like the tutorial that I make about how to prepare partner data in Stata. There was a question that it was quite challenging uh, me to make another tutorial is connected with how to create the how, how to calculate the fixed effect in panel data recreation and how to read it so i tried to create it and i made it in my website so if you are interested we have um, my website here is called connecting freelancers.com uh, and i make the analysis about what is fixed effect estimator so what the definitions and how to uh, how to calculate it so basically like uh, you use fixed effects uh, whenever you are only interested in analyzing the impact of variable that's very over time so what that mean uh, it means like you will try to remove all the variable that they are constant so let's see like uh, the mathematic formula for this fixed effect variable uh, fixed effects in Panel data regression is like if you got like this uh, this model that y equal y that vary in the model like uh, here is the fatalities in the accident we use the data from Christopher Baum so y is fatalities and this is a couple of variables that vary over time and there is like unobserved heterogeneity and this is like epsilon this error we have uh, kind of believe that the covariance between the uh, heterogeneity unobserved with the sum of variable is not equal with zero which is then it's uh, it's not comply with the data that can be used to to be researched so that's why we try to use fixed effect by try to find the uh, mean from the uh, dependent variable from uh, uh, an independent variable and from the error and it gives us the formula that we try to demean them by like, uh, like uh, by minusing the dependent variable with the mean or the uh, that or the average of the value of y across the time and then happen also to independent variable and here for the unobserved heterogeneity they are that not changing over time will be removed to zero and uh, then the last one is error then we also minus it with the mean of error so we got the data like uh, of line of the y uh, dependent variable and uh, independent variable and error so how the stata command first uh, we will use two files if you don't know how to use two files you can go to this video and then one way fix effect estimators like what data that we use we use going we're gonna use data from sd example here we will take from Christopher Baum. We will download them. I already download, so you can take a look later. And then we going to, if you are want to use your own data and you want to prepare it, you can also go to this video, which is explaining about how to prepare panel data. But if you already want to test with the data that we have, we can go to use this. Okay, this is the command to for fix effects. So let's go to Stata directly. Okay, so here we got the interface of Stata. <coughs> let's first open the data editor that we have. Okay, so here we will open one data variables. We call it as a traffic. And we got this all data like there is state here and then uh, here is an employment rate spiritus consumption 
capital income per uh, cap, uh, capital per income per capita and then tax of beer and many others unobserved heterogeneity that as you could see we have so many other different variable and this is not me who collect this data it was from Christopher Baum okay so we already got all this information and what we want to check now is we want to count this fatality the impact as a dependent variable uh, and then we will use the uh, like others uh, variable as the, the independent variable so as you could see I'm taking it from here data that I have is data from Christopher Baum and then here uh, what I'm going to use is like I will just type here xt rec and then dependent variable is fatal beer tax and then uh, spiritus consumption and then unrate and then income per capita and then the most important is like typing fixed effect okay something wrong i think spear uh -huh. i think i type it wrongly i should type sorry guys i think it should be spear consumption spiritus consumption yeah vodka consumption per inch get down then fb boom so we got the data here so how to read this data first is like we have a number of observations uh, there are 48 group and seven years so if you multiply them it will be 336 and then what's that is important as you could see like um, beer tax is uh, having opposite uh, impact to the fatality of the accident it means like the government when they put the beer the tax to the beer the amount of uh, accident is decreasing spiritus consumption it's definitely affect to uh, the amount of fatalities unemployment rate it's having minus so when someone having higher unemployment the uh, amount of fatalities is decreasing yes perhaps like people who unemployed they are driving less and then in come per capita it's actually affect positive with the fatality so it's like someone who are having higher um, salary they tend to buy like a much more expensive car and it's like happening and it's make like fatalities higher so this is one direct uh, fe how to read it this so all this uh, probability of t is like under 0 0.01 it means like all of this hypothesis is accepted and then the amount of rho rho is like the intra-class correlation it means like the correlation among oh sorry inside the group is pretty high and then the model is okay because the probability of f is less than zero i mean like less than zero zero one okay so that's how to read the fixed effect here the next question is like uh, what if we think like actually the variable matters so we want to check like actually there is impact if we, uh, uh, that happening if we put also the variable that's why it's called like two-way fixed effect estimator because you want to put uh, much more year and let's see how to do that first we will do like uh, do file so we will quickly tablet here and generate the year so let's open here we can use the do file editor and then we will run the first one okay as you could see we are generate a year and then we will also create like year by year dummy variable 
but later we will use it in the regressions and let's come back again to stata and then let's use uh, to file editor okay and we will run all of them and let's see in data editor as you could see they are already a year 82 83 85 86 87 and we can drop the year of 7 and then let's go first to directly to the command drop a year one <coughs> and let's put also the impact of the of the year so as you could see like here uh, there are like times differences so we when we put like uh, a year 82 83 84 85 86 87 here is like as you could see the variance the, the beta is also changing over time and the model also still significant and as you could see like year 82 it's somehow different with 83 because 83 maybe is not really significant so there are like change there is differences and in 87 it's even more insignificant because perhaps by the implementation of the regulation it makes uh, that the model become not very much uh, suit anymore so that's why there are like if we want to go across the time and this is like what we call it as the fixed effect that we want to put attention that we exclude anything that it's constant in terms of time and then we can see uh, the impact from two ways uh, uh, fixed effects yeah so that's how it looks like hopefully the explanation is useful for you guys and yeah if you have any question feel free um, to ask in the YouTube this is I also put like how to read the fixed effects and then also the time rules that you need to put attention like row the constant the p and the probability of f okay uh, if you think it's like useful feel free to subscribe i will also try to updating more and more about the tutorial in stata if you see it's like quite confusing maybe uh, in the future i will try to make much more step-by-step uh, -step explanations okay so that's all for now Thank you very much and see you in the next video. Bye bye.